Welcome back to the final day. Day 24? Dun, dun, dun. 25 today? Or 25. It's 25, sorry. 24 and a half, we'll call it. Perfect. I'm a day off here. No, because it was yesterday, right? We were a day late. Day late in dollar short. Okay. Sorry. So 24. Day 24. Inflation so, is now two dollars short, but you know, different <laughs> subject. Um, today we have the Streetside uh, Brewery, and it is an interstate pastry fight imperial chocolate donut stout. Okay. Pastry stout. It says pastry fight. Oh. And what are we speaking, fighting with our pastries? Speaking of pastries, should we have a Christmas cookie? I prefer those sweaty balls, but... We should introduce our guest and cookie maker, <laughs> Aunt Krista, here to join us on our Thank final evening. Ta -ta. Ta -ta. Oh. I don't know why they call her that, but <laughs> move that out of this <laughs> kid-friendly show. Anyways, here's what this says. It says, this collaboration, Imperial Stroll, uh brings Streetside back to their Dayton roots. Uh, we brought in the incredible Barrel House and the amazing Evans Bakery mm. to make the thickest, oh, chocolatiest, chocolatiest, yep, and this is a beer, um, donutiest, <laughs> those aren't words, okay, thank you, um, stout we could make. Interstate Pastry Fight has notes of milk, chocolate, so this is what you're looking for to rate it, milk, okay. chocolate, um, vanilla cream, and tasty, tasty donut. Yeah. Uh, thank you for the Barrel House and Evans Bakery <coughs> for helping us put this pastry party together. It is a 10.3% alcohol. Yeah. So that's gonna start your night off well. This is yeah, good thing we're splitting it in threes tonight. Good way to end the Christmas. Yeah, first of all, Merry Christmas. Um, got the package of you today. That's that's great. We're celebrating that. One more win. Next week when we're at Lambo. Getting yeah. that last W. <laughs> you got to get those queens. Woo! Next week. Krista lives across the river from us. So I, I would make you very happy to beat the Vice Queens. So. She's true and true a Packer fan, but lives on the other side. We still love her. <laughs> okay. So let's give her the there, sniff. There are some good breweries up there. Oh, yes. I'm just some saying. Good. Well, mm. cheers to the pack next week. Whoop, whoop. Getting in the playoffs and a Merry Christmas. Wow, I thought that was gonna be boozy. Mm. 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 I don't even, I don't know. <laughs> it's not at all what I thought it was gonna be. It's okay. not, it's like fairly light actually. Yeah. Like it's not, it's a little fizzy and, and not light. Not as stouty as I. Mm -hmm. I can taste the chocolate. Yep. Yeah. It's got, it's like the aftertaste. The aftertaste is it's the chocolate. chocolate. I, I don't, I don't taste, taste donut. Or van I don't get the vanilla. I just can't believe how light it is. Like, it's not pontoon crushable oh, by gosh, any no. stretch. Mm -hmm. Maybe snowmobile crushable. Like, if you're out cold winter night. It's kind of warm me up a little. 16 ounces. But yeah, it's just like. I don't know if I've ever said a stout was like refreshing, but it's almost like mm -hmm. I'd have, I I want another sip of it. It is, it is good. Yeah, I don't. Like you said, I'm a little taken back. I don't know if I expected that. Right. So it's kind of throwing me for a loop. It is one of the better darker beers. It reminds me more of like a porter. Like sometimes the porter, I mean, they're a darker colored beer, but they're not that like they look heavy, more frothier. Yeah. Hmm. I don't know. Uh, Chris, what do you think? You got any thoughts so, on this here yeah. beer? It definitely tastes of chocolate. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. But, yeah, it, it definitely, when you were reading it, I didn't expect this. It's, no, like I mean, I think it is a... I no. couldn't drink maybe a whole can of it. Right. The can art's pretty good. They're going it's, down the... It's interesting. The interstate... Pastry highway, chucking donuts at people. I don't know why you do that. The waste of a good donut, especially if Evans Bakery is as good as they say. <laughs> we looked them up in pre-production. But I'm sure they got good donuts. Like the world's best cup of coffee. Congratulations! You did it! 
Elf. Elf. Yes, elf. Right. The world's best cup of coffee. Chris, can you use your phone for a second? Can I? Can oh, let's just a... go to it. We don't need it. Oh, I was gonna check the untap score. Ah. Oh, sorry. We'll come I'm back sure to it. Untap score. James. And yeah. I okay. Don't know what they're talking let's about? Go right so. to it. Okay, you're gonna you're gonna judge on a scale of one being pour out to five best pastry stout you've ever had. I'm gonna go and lead out. Okay. I'm giving this a 4.0, maybe 4.25. I don't know what I would need to add to it to bring it up higher, but uh, I like it. It's a good beer. It's it just. It's not like a stout I've had really before. I don't know. Yeah, so 4.0, good I'm, beer. I'm right along with you. I might go 3.75. I like the beer, but I taste the chocolate, mm -hmm. and I don't get the vanilla and the donut piece yeah, of it. Yeah, I can it. see that. And I don't, I would love to, I mean, donuts are awesome, and you want that little pastry That's taste to it. I just get the yeah. chocolate, so. Maybe if yeah, you threw a little definitely fruit. definitely agree with that. I'd say like a 3.99, just because I, I don't want to quite well, go to a four. Okay, okay. But you know, it's a it's a good good solid three. We're not splitting hairs, but we're close to a four. But <laughs> it's not quite that. there. All right, Love stay. It. You keep working at that. Yeah. I think maybe if you had a little fruit, like a maybe raspberry. If you had it with the cookie. Yeah, if you had like a little raspberry flavoring or something, might kind of. But you don't good. taste. It's really like you said, Michelle, just the chocolate. Mm -hmm. Like, mm -hmm. it's Again, not bad. Didn't not, help. Not good with the cookie. No. no. I don't taste much of the other stuff. So, but not a bad beer. No. no. Chris, Again. do you want to do the honors of yes. opening our next beer? So, day thirteen of the brewing project, Admin Calendar. Oh. What do we have the other night? It was the uh, apocalypse. Like, Delicious. Oh, yeah, yeah. And we Again. had a goose A and goose Island. Bra the cleansing brought to you by the kitchen of Auntie Tata. Do you want to rinse these out? I should do that. Oh, okay. okay. What do we. Ooh. Very fancy cans. Yeah, look at this bump in the night. Usually it's not a, what I'm considering a bump in the night, but. <laughs> 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 but we'll go with it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well, she just went there, folks. <laughs> oh, it's another Imperial Stout. So now we'll be able to kind of, we'll Ooh. be able to compare an Imperial Stout. It's um, like Brewing Project knew what we were doing. Right? <laughs> um, with Bavarian cream flavoring mm. and natural flavors. Again, it's a 9.25% alcohol. I mean. Good canner. Interesting. It's, it's definitely good canner. Yeah. Can show them the people. And we did, yeah. I don't know. What do you think Bavarian cream is? Is that like, I mean, I think Bavarian cream, that's like donut -y again, don't you think? Is that the filling in a donut? It's, it could be like the, kind of like Bailey's like cream too. Like a, mm. I just got my hopes up that this tastes like Bailey's. Oh, I never know. Okay. We've never been to Bavaria, so I guess we'll uh, find out. I also like to highlight this 1970s Schlitz hat. Pretty nice. Vintage. It's the first it's, hat. It's vintage my, Burns. Yeah, hat. the first hat uh, Bob Burns gave Lynn Burns, evidently. <laughs> They're sitting in the living room looking at us like we're crazy. Okay. Well, Got a Nancy taste in. Yeah, what the <laughs> heck? You can't. Ooh, ooh, ooh I ooh, like the smell the of smell? this one better. You're going to like it. Just the smell is delish. It's like I a, got there early, just like when I got to Grand like a, Torino early. When Ooh. I went to see that with Matt. Mm. Oh, okay. Ah, right, Matt? Yum. Cheers, buddy. That has... That is good beer. That has that sweet mm. taste I was mm -hmm. looking for in the last one. Totally agree. So I would maybe... I don't know if I can do this, but it's America. I can do whatever I want. I'm going to put Marco. this back to a 375. Yeah. I, or at I least have for sure a my... 4. I, th I was maybe going to go to a 4.25, but I'm not. Because this is definitely better. The bump mm -hmm. in the night is a step above the pastry fight. Wait I really go. like this. <laughs> Way to go, Brewing Project. This is not dynamite. Kind of dead. It's got a little, that it's, cream, it's, like... I was going to say, it's sweet. kind of like their, like, the a combo cream. of their mm -hmm. fruity... Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. It does have a fruity taste to it. With a little bit of the, the stout, too. But yes. well, What's the fruit flavor? It's like a... Bavarian cream. Mm -hmm. you know, is 
is cream of fruit in Bavaria. But, I've never been. But think about Bavarian cream. I like you said. I think it's that filling inside of donuts and that. But I get like a strawberry or like yeah, a cherry. There's something. Like a cherry taste almost to it. Well, it has other natural flavors. <laughs> like what? I don't know. Well, you got to read the fine print. Brewing yeah. project. What are these other natural flavors? Is it cherry? Because that's no. what I taste. Ooh. You try it. Take another sip. I Probably. do actually. Now you, you say taste that. the cherry. I don't see any cherries in the can art. That's one of those crinkle, crinkle donuts. You know the flat things. Oh, a Kringle, a, not a Kringle. Kringle. A yeah. Kringle. Maybe that's what it's like a yeah, raspberry. Jean always brings to that. Yeah, Maybe that's kind of what it tastes like. Ah, it is. I think it's, it's a all cherry. coming together. Ooh, oh, boy. <laughs> We're channeling now. We're vibing, as the kids would say. <laughs> only took us a handful of drinks to figure it out. Ooh, yeah. I think it's a cherry Kringle. Yeah. Like, spot on. They should change the name to Bump the Cherry Kringle in the Night. <laughs> don't don't google that i don't know what'll come up on your search history it could upset your wife so just fair warning <laughs> the cherry is so that, is that kind of like blow deck <laughs> blow deck below deck, below deck. Here's oh, your old big top chautauqua in case you've been up there to way up north shawam again Ashland, Wisconsin. Like we like to say, Chimam again. Mm -hmm. Dos a beer. Mm -hmm. I drink Kristen, my beer. Why don't you... Uh, bar, a long, long way to the bar. <laughs> Me, I drink. I drink the beer. Keep going. <laughs> What's that? Do, re, mi, oh, I, fa, la. No, I screwed it up. Oh, I, man. I forgot Ray behind the bar. Mm, bar oh, is Ray. a long, long way to the bar. Me or do re mi fa so so I'll drink another beer beer do re mi fa so la 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 tea no thanks I'll have a beer beer that'll bring us back to beer those beers those beers por favor we're performing later tonight as well. Uh, Tonic Solfa just hired us to be their lead opener, so see us next year on tour. <laughs> I'm hoping Pentatonic picks us up. I was going to say, I was maybe more good Pentatonic, too. or yeah. Chris, so why don't you uh, give us your thoughts yeah. and rating on the beer? We'll let you lead out. I definitely like the, you know, the, the fruity, natural Kringle flavor, so yeah. Bavarian cream. Um, I would say this is like a 4.8. Ooh, Jumping so I, I could definitely drink a can of this not, and be happy. Not pontoon crushable though. This would not be something you would crush no, on the pontoon. Probably not pontoon crushable, but this is like hard. a good ice shack crushable. This is like a good like I'm hanging out by the fire roasting marshmallows crushable. Ooh, Ooh. good call, good call. Mm -hmm. Yeah, yeah, yeah with I a like s'more. It. Yep. Yeah, have that. Mm -hmm. yeah. I like it. Um, I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go 4.5 again. I don't know. I taste, I taste more than what they put on their can. Yeah. Um, I think it should be cherry Bavarian cream, really. Um, but yeah, I think I don't know what it could do to be better as an imperial stout. You know those little chocolates that have the cherry and cream on the inside? Kind of almost like tastes like that Chocolate covered too. cherries. Yeah, that's what, <laughs> that's what they call. Them. Thanks. I'm glad you're here, Krista. Thanks for joining us. Uh, really spell that out simply. Uh, I like this more than the other one. The other one was good. This is definitely, I'd say, a 4.5, which is, I think, on the stout scale of beers, is really high. And so on the regular scale of beers, this is pretty high. Like, I like a stout, but they're not usually my go to. Not usually what I'm going to pick off the shelf or, but I could drink a can of this. Mm -hmm. I don't know if I'd have more than one, but. It's a nice. Yeah, it's a really nice beer. Depends on what he's doing. Like, sits out by the fire. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I think it's more winter beer. Yeah. I feel like these dark beers are more winter beers to me. You don't want to be drinking this in July. No. Not really. But. Not really at all. But hey. Well, we've really enjoyed this journey. And we, Thanks uh, for letting me join. Hopefully be back Anytime. next year to, to do some more beer reviews with you. And if you want us to review anything, yeah, send it to us. We'll review it. We'll let Matthew post it. But 
Go Whatever. pack. We're, we're open to anything, really. Yeah. Go Keep pack. It. Yeah. Kick the Vikings butt. That's Please. all. Until next year. I don't care if you don't even go to the playoffs. Just beat the Vikings. Agreed. That's all I need. Also agreed. <laughs> Final <laughs> thoughts, Michelle? No, this has been a fun journey. Um, we tasted a lot of great beers, and I look forward to next year. Ho, Crystal? ho, ho. Yeah, thanks. Thanks for joining us. Oh. <laughs> Make sure you eat your Christmas cookies now, because... Go get your bump in the night. Oh, boy. <laughs> Just right, we're going to have to end on that. <laughs> we're going to have to call our quits. Merry Christmas. See ya.